Oh my goodness. This is taking forever. I mean, I've probably been running now for, I don't know, at least three kilometers, I would say. I haven't heard any shots or anything. I mean, okay, in... I guess in the mod's defense, I have been just kind of running around and keeping into the woods, so... I don't really think I can judge it just yet. But, uh... I don't know, maybe, maybe if I come up here, I can get a better... Oh my goodness. I have found a compound. Alright, so I am definitely going to go down there and check that out. Um, could end up getting shot if there is uh, one of the homeowners are down there. But, uh, yeah, this this is definitely the most interesting thing that I've seen in, in the past 15 minutes. I'm going to be honest with you. Besides rocks and trees. But like I said, I mean, I've been, you know, trying to kind of stay out of sight. So I don't know. We're gonna come down here though, like I said, and we're gonna check out or check out some of these bases. Um, like I was saying before, they're really not anything like the uh, bases that you would find in Epoch or Overpoch. So yeah, they they definitely look pretty interesting. I wanted to show you guys. I mean, I'm sure you guys have seen it before, but I just kind of want to get up close and personal with it, and you know, be able to capture some actual video of these bases. So. Alright, so there's a guy on here named Dark Matter, and he was saying friendly, and I kind of ignored it, but but then he was, but you know, right there, he said, uh, can I come out without being shot? So I'm thinking he could be in one of these bases right here. I mean, if he saw me cross the road, which, I mean, if he is in there, he probably did. I got a heli flying overhead somewhere, too, so kind of worried about running out right now because of that guy as well but this guy could be inside of one of these bases and if he's friendly he got out already huh well. <laughs> okay so apparently okay obviously he wasn't talking to me unless I just didn't hear a gunshot I think he was about to say I'm friendly but then after he got halfway into his sentence, he, uh, he got killed, so. Oh, it's unfortunate for him. Alright, um, just kind of waiting for that helicopter to go away, and I'll come go check out some of those bases. I mean, they, I mean, e even from this distance, they look pretty interesting, but like I said, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get up close. I'm gonna get up close and check these things out. <clears throat> um, let's see, I just, I just really want to make sure there's no one running around, because I don't know if they're gonna be friendly or not. I mean, I could tell them that I'm friendly, but at the same time, you don't know how their reaction is gonna be. You know, like that, like that one guy that just got killed, that I thought that was in one of these bases right here. <clears throat> but yeah, there's like little... I think that's a tent. I'm not exactly sure. I mean... Maybe if I looked at some of the pictures of the bases, I don't have time to alt-tab out, really. I mean, I do have time, but at the same time, I'm kind of worried about uh, someone running up on me and trying to shoot me, because I got some okay cover on one side, but not on the other side, so... I don't know. I think I might run into this town behind me real quick and see if I can get some supplies. Okay, here's one of these uh, those camping tents I was telling you guys about earlier. <clears throat> I mean, I think that they're a little bit bigger than normal. Oh my god, this fucking zombie beside me has got like the raspiest fucking yell ever. Um, he sounds like a like a like a chihuahua. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm here in the town now that was, uh, right near the bases or whatever, but just trying to get some supplies, and I hate the fact that some of these things you just can't run past, but, uh, it's all good. It's all good. 
still have my Winchester. I hope to find a better gun at some point. I know there's a firehouse in this town. I might try to go down there and see if there's something there. A bunch of bottles and empty cans. What the hell? Bag of cement? Okay. I don't think I'm going to need that. I mean, really, there, there's a shit ton of food in this gas station. Or the convenience store. Corner store, whatever the hell you want to call it. Just take some ammo. I do need to find a better pistol than this Makarov. I mean, I got plenty of ammo for the Makarov, but... I don't know. It's just not as powerful as I would want it to be. I want to find a revolver at some point. I did find some ammo for that just a minute ago, and yeah. Alright, but I think I found most of the stuff that I can find in this corner store for right now, so... I don't know. I think I'm going to go ahead and head to that firehouse. Because like I said, I would like to find a better gun than this Winchester. I mean, I'm sure that the Winchester does decent at a, a certain range. But I'm not exactly sure what that range is. Because I've never used a Winchester before. And I've never really bothered to look into it. So, I don't know. Yeah, there's a, there's a fire station down here. Tank in the middle of the road. Can't do anything with that tank, though. Um, I mean, I guess you could hide beside it or something. I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to come down here and check out this firehouse. Maybe even that hospital over there on my right, too. I don't know. I'm not sure if there is anyone on. Or, like, anyone over here. Like, on this side of the island. SKS. Huh. That might be better. It's another SKS. Well, I guess... I guess since I got enough ammo, I can go ahead and switch it up. Yeah, fuck it. I got some ammo over there. I got some ammo over here. I think... I mean, just... Just going by what I would kind of know, I think the SKS would probably be better than the, uh... Than the Winchester. Nothing in those things. Uh, what else? I think I need... Okay, a revolver would be nice. If I could find a revolver, I would be golden. Because there's, there's some more ammo right there, too. Take the painkillers, and... That. Uh, nothing up here. And nothing up here. I mean, there's a gun, but there's no ammo, so I'm not even going to bother with it. Um, shit. Guess I'll go check the hospital real quick. I mean, I'm sure that there's something in there I can use, right? Right? Bandages or something like that? I don't know. I mean, I got most of the stuff, but whatever. Maybe they even that church, too. Alright, so I went and checked out the hospital, and there wasn't really jack shit in there. Uh... So I'm thinking someone was over here, because the glass on the front of the hospital was broken. So I'm thinking that there could be somebody over here. So I'm just kind of... Kind of peeping everything out and making sure nobody sneaks up on me. I'm going to check this out real quick and make sure there's no one running around there. Hmm. I think I'm going to go for it. I don't see any movement. I don't see any zombies. I think it's good. Could be someone on the side of that hill. Uh, if there is, I hope they don't shoot me. Because, I mean, I just want to come over here and check out these houses. This would be the, uh, the first time that I've actually come across, like, bases like this, you know? Now, I'm probably, at some point or another, going to alt-tab. There's some zombies over there, but I think I spawned those in earlier. But yeah, at some point, I'm going to alt-tab, and I'm going to read some more into these bases and everything and kind of give you guys a better idea of how they work. Uh, I mean, I know that there's bandit, uh, ban like bandit houses, bandit uh, bases. Okay, so you just look at it, and it'll tell you who built it. That's pretty cool. 
Oh, mailbox, a little gate, two heads on a steak, or steaks. Not like the steaks that you eat, but like wooden steaks, you know. This guy's got like a doghouse beside his hut. Um, I don't think that there's any way to get into them. Or else I would try it. Like, I mean, I'm sure you would be able to if you either built the base or... I don't know if they have like a tag as friendly system on this kind of mod. Or on this mod, but... Yeah. It would be cool if you could like write messages to people and put them in the mailboxes. But I don't know. I wonder if any of these guys are on, actually. Mm, no. I don't think any of the names that I saw match any of the people that are on right now, so I don't know, this is kind of a nice little commune, I guess, of different bases. Uh, I mean, there's really nothing else to check out down here right now, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and keep heading, like, northish, and hope that I can come across some barracks, or something, something a little bit more interesting than nothing, pretty much. Because I'm having a hard time... I'm not really having, like, a difficult time enjoying this mod right now, but... I don't know. There, there, there gets a certain point in my day where I hit, like, 30 minutes and I haven't come across anything worthwhile, in my opinion, I guess. To, and I kind of get bored very easily, so... I do not know. But anyways, like I was saying, I'm going to go up north, or I'm going to continue my venture up north, see if I can come across anything, and hopefully I do, because, yeah, I don't know. I'm getting kind of bored right now, so, and I'm sure you guys are too, but anyways, yeah, I'm going to keep heading up north.